Alright, today we are going to learn how to solve linear systems of equations by graphing substitution and elimination. First, we are going to solve by graphing. Now, to do this, we must set both of the equations equal to y. Um, okay, so with the first equation, we are going to subtract the 4x and get negative y minus 4x plus 8 and then we divide it by negative 1 both sides by negative 1 and get y equals 4x minus 8 alright now the second equation we subtract the 2x get 4 plus 6 and then we divide, we divide both sides by 4 we should get y equals negative 1 half x plus 1.5 alright now we graph them and see where they intersect all right, first equation, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and it goes up 4, two, 3, 4, to the side 1, up 4, to the side 1. I'll draw the line. Alright, now the second equation. Right there, y intercept. And down one. Over two. So it intersects right there. And now, we your answer should be the point of intersection interception, which is which is zero two. Now we're going to learn a second way to solve. It's called substitution. So first, we're going to subtract two x from both sides getting negative y equals negative 2x plus 4. Then we divide by negative 1, both sides. Making it y equals 2x minus 4. We put this y into the y right here, making it 6x plus 2 times 2x minus 4 equals 10. Then we distribute the 2, making it 6x plus 4x minus 8 equals 10. And add these two, making it 10x, and add the 8 to both sides, making it 10x equals 18. And then we divide by both sides, making x equal 1.8. Then we plug x into either equation, but I'm going to plug it into this one to make it easier. So it's 2 times 1.8 minus y equals 4. And then 
we subtract the 3.6 from both sides, making it negative y equals point 0.4. Then we divide by negative 1 on both sides, making y equal negative point 0.4. So your final answer is x equals 1.8 and y equals negative 0.4. Okay, the third way to solve is elimination. And you see over here uh, at the problem, it's 3x plus 4y equals 12 and 5x minus 4y equals 4. Um, to make it easier, it, you, you use the like, same variables and opposite signs. And yeah, so it would be 8x, oops, equals 16, since the 4's cancel out and you would just add the 3 x and the 5x and the 12 and the 4. So that would be x equals 2. And then you would plug the x into one of the equations and that would be, I'm going to choose the first one. So it would be 3 <laughs> times 2 plus 4y. equals 12. So that would be 6 plus 4y equals 12. And then you would minus the 6 over so you would get 4y equals 6. And then you would divide the 4 by the 6, which would get you y equals 1.5. There we go. Or you could do the fraction 6 fourths. And those are your x and y answers over here. And we're done.